This is the counter-protest, mobilised when a far-right group planned to march on Golders Green, a traditionally Jewish area and a deliberately provocative act by their leader, who's now facing criminal action and couldn't attend today. Police banned that demonstration, but instead this group that many are calling neo-Nazis was allowed to assemble opposite Downing Street, with their hundreds of opponents being kept just a few metres away. There are 25, 25 fascist scum have managed to crawl out. I call that a bit of a pathetic turnout. Boring, boring, boring. <laughs> this is England, not Nazi Germany. We fought you. We don't want your hatred. We will not be intimidated by you people no more. We will stand here in united numbers and say no. It's very important to very clearly send a strong message that they're not welcome. Um, I don't think that uh, it's useful to only deal with it when they're sort of in our neighbourhood. Uh, that we need, to, we need to deal with it wherever it is. The far right groups say they take issue with Sean Rim, a group of Orthodox Jews in Stamford Hill in Hackney, who operate with the blessing of the Met Police as a very active and self-policing neighbourhood watch organisation. Everybody has a right to self-determination and, and, and we are not being represented in this country. We, uh, our, our human rights aren't being represented. It's all the ethnic and foreigners all being human rights and represented. Yeah? So behind me you can see a very small Nazi protest or Nazi sympathisers, shall we call them, um, but it has attracted quite a lot of animosity from another protest over that way. Uh, there were a few moments where it possibly got a little bit heated, but uh, it seems to have disseminated. It is a very small protest, I must say. It seems, certainly, that uh, there won't be any trouble in the near future. And indeed, it did pass off peacefully, with no arrests on the day. And what today showed was, more than ever, there isn't a Nazi threat in this country. You know, the BNP, the EDL, the political wings, they are toothless. They have no power, they carry no weight whatsoever. And it's just thugs and losers and people whose lives have taken a, a terrible turn that just stand on the street for an hour waving a flag with a microphone in their hands. They're no threat to anyone.